The one-time password app can be used as an alternate login method. Once configured, you'll no longer be prompted to answer the security questions when logging in from a device not connected to the college network. Note that you will require the use of a mobile device. First, we need to acquire the app. In this case, we are using an Android device. The setup is similar for an iOS device. Go to the App Store for your mobile device, download and install the One Login OTP app. Select the Play Store app for Android or the App Store for an iOS device. In the search field, type One Login. Select One Login Protect and download and install to your mobile device. We will now set up the Portage College login portal to use OTP. We first need to log in normally using the security questions that were already defined. We now go over to the user menu and select profile. Under the two-factor authentication, click on the plus symbol to set the OTP. A new screen will appear with a barcode. Start the One Login Protect app on your mobile device. On One Login Protect app, select Setup Now. We will scan the barcode directly from the monitor. The mobile's camera will start automatically. Just point it toward the screen. Make sure that you can see the barcode within the blue square. A green check mark will appear when the One Login Protect app recognizes the barcode. Notice that a new device called One Login Protect appears, which we will set up as the default two factor authentication. Around the middle section of one login row, over your cursor until you see Set as Default and click. Select Continue and now OTP will be the default. We can now log in using the OTP method. Enter your login credential as usual and click Enter. The OTP app will start automatically as the service is pushed to your device. After clicking Accept, you will automatically be logged in. From now on to use the OTP app, you will need access to your mobile device. You can revert to the security questions if access to your mobile device is unavailable. To log with the two security questions, again click on the change at the two-factor authentication screen. Now select one login security questions. You can now use the security questions instead of OTP.